Today is February the 12th, 2010, and I'm going to make a set of videos, 10 all together, each one short, and what I'm going to try to determine is for you to observe vintage 6550s versus the new ones. We're going to use a Dynaco Mark III amplifier. The uh, driver board has been changed to a DIY tube Poseidon, which uses a 12AX7 and a 12AU7. The 12AX is a nice Amperex. These tubes have been carefully chosen and used many times here. This is a uh, Telefunken 12AU7. I get a lot better uh, performance out of this new board than I do the old board, primarily because as many 6INHs as I have, not very many of them are any good. Our two 6550s will go here, and here we have a vintage uh, 5AR4. It doesn't have a brand on it, so I don't actually know who made it, but it works well. We're going to use a Tektronix voltmeter to adjust the bias in each case. With each tube will always set the voltage to 120. We're going to use Tektronix equipment. An SG505 oscillator. An AA501 distortion analyzer. Voltmeter. Oscilloscope to look at the signal. And frequency up here. Dummy load is a air-cooled set of 8 ohm, 2 of them, 200 watt, 8 ohm loads. We're going only going to use one because we're going to be testing sets of tubes. These are RCA. This one measures 56 and 50. These are Jan 6550s. They measure 50 and 56. These are GE. They measure 52 and 54. And these are a pair of RCAs measuring 56 and 58. All measured on an old TVU, TV7 AU tube tester. Also, after these four tubes are used or uh, tested, we're going to test them at 2 kilohertz and 20 hertz. 2,000 cycles per second and 20 cycles per second. And it's all going to be displayed right here for you to look at and make your own determination which tubes you think works best. This is the longest video. This is just to show the equipment what the setup is. Over here is where we have our voltmeter plugged in. We have a 600 ohm load here. This is our input from the oscillator. It's got a dummy load on it, 600 ohms too. So it was properly terminated. Everything's, everything's done to the best I can, the best I can do it. And uh, we're going to see how they perform and you can uh, judge for yourself. Basically this is a, t a, uh, a test between the old tubes and the new tubes. The vintage tubes, which we pay so much for sometimes on eBay, <coughs> and the new tubes. The Russian tubes, the new tubes I'm going to be testing are the Russian tubes and the Chinese tubes. These are all made in USA here. These are all vintage. These have a code date of 7548. These have a code date of 6822. I don't think there's a code date on these. I never saw one, but it says 6550A USA. And these are 6550s. They're stamped RCA. It's almost rubbed off, but it says uh, 6550 USA. Also, in the new tubes, I'm going to have the the new gold lion tubes 
which seem to perform pretty well. But we'll see. Hope you enjoy.